We share a nightmare in common with Tony Blair. When he was lurking in the stair, we barely noticed he was there. But after all the time and care we spent now, we feel we're left with a dent of shame and place and spark. While 299 does go, 599 go three. So death spark to circle H would go 12 and go 12 o'clock 12 because six is not out for four. Continue to depose the lurking madness because building a fort can only keep you busy. It can't keep you safe from the tunneling madness. The problem with our current solution is it doesn't involve verticality, but the lethality of our enemy does so, indeed, doth do. The invocation of primal instinct in the floundering of the madcap dance lion does not prevent a resurgence of recourse to do into the process all the dewlaps in the mountain. The claw on the foot of a hammer chimes like a ringing endorsement of your absolute indictment in the fridge of the incident. The incidence of these fridges reproves the recriminations before the yuletide defense of the windowless defenestration of the banister of the armoire dribbling dots on a sandwich made of grief. The flexing of all the bones goes into a cinnamon cascade that proves the cynic's critics and criticizes the cynical proof inherent in the cascading spice that surges in the night sky like a tree surgeon burning his wages for a chance at the spine. He became a spinal crack doctor hack in the medium wall space that he crawled into because all space is a crawl space when you crawl into that place and by transferring himself from one wallway to another he became a sea urchin and traded with 17 banisters at once in some kind of church banquet that he didn't feed for but he did eat. Bundles are available now with cable and without fiber optics that can dig into your skull and transplant what you used to think with the new things that you do. Think now, you will not remember this process because you will already be evaporated by the prison sentiment that we strung up like lights each December, but melted like icicles each March. We like each March to tart itself up like a trollop, because when we dally with dollops of such tarts, we like the part we play to be of a piece with our soul suit, and our soul provision in that suit is that we embellish the disco heaven with a kind of risky pig that doesn't do burlesque unless you summer in Sussex, and then we winter in Wessex. The mess of the whole thing is Chichester, is one with the lemming prince who we must throw down, or the onion king will never ride. The peril horse of Pearl Doom, or the pearl horse of Madison McConnelly, my least favorite medicine invention. Thomas the Crank mentioned a tangy sensation that ain't clenching the deal here with the seal beer. Six seals, drink beer, six teal seals, seal beer in a seaside sealing factory that produces flooring as well and adds fluorine to water while flooring the gas and guzzling the past muzzle of boring daughters and rascally fuzz pouring healing factors that are more than appealing actors in a play. They are the kind of things you see lined up in a sealing wax parade that doesn't seal an otter of ottomans, filling up the circus of your couch with a discus that doesn't slouch and a hurdle that doesn't leap. Peep, peep. I was sleeping in my sleep all through the Saturday night bash bash. I was smashing my crash when I flashed my disco lights. Strobe, strobe. I was having a stroke all up on my couch today, thrashing and thrashing through the flooring I was clashing. I was crashing through the floor with a purple shirt and a yellow drawer, hanging out my onion ring because that's the thing with the old west times. The whole onion ring is a super good place for women folk. Chapter 17 of the paragraph was enveloped by the stain. We had to move on to chapter 18, but we subtracted naught 573 minus zero was a claim that we did not make dash, we did not make crawl, we did not make crash. We're making a hash of the passion I bring to the center of the ring. When I go, dark water. I forgot to say zero, they forgot to say it for me. All that I do is propel myself through an endless weight of glue that doesn't pour at all. It crashes because it dried 10 years ago and it weighs over 40,000 tons. The metric farm that had been producing this glue was working in tandem with guerrilla warfare tactics and chicken islands to provide one winter solstice worth of mega jewels to every farmland on England. And when England rose 
spends that summer in the sunset upon it, as it was fated to do since dawn. In memorial, we all smoked aloud, because we believed that the fire would burn our lungs in the proper method that would transmit our signals abroad. And when we went lengthwise, we found that it did not do less than that at all. So I don't understand why you are mocking me. I haven't been to princelings once, but I was one princelings twice. So that is why my Pringles shouldn't not suffice for collateral in this agreement. Your muck-stained donkey habituation will continue to pound itself forward and backward into yen itself up and down the block like some kind of Deutsche Mark. Because the thing about printing out Christmas letters is that if you don't fold it, it doesn't look like a card. And so nobody finds it festive. And if nobody finds it festive, can it truly be said to be celebratory? In all my time is a trial lawyer. I've never been a trial lawyer, but none of that time counts as an essential aspect of my temporal makeup because the foundation wore off in the rain and by mascara always is running good serve because I want people to know how much I cry and some very good cardiovascular shape for mascara. And I should know because I've been a mascara cardiologist since Batman first came to this country and the love of the Lord spawned down upon me. I have been providing surgery to any shape, form or makeup that might crawl out of my bacon banana hammock factory produce section. I'll market fever, but banana, and if I might market fever banana, then what might you market good sir or madam turn on binary individual? If a clownfish can hear me, it might process the signal of the waves, but it would not know. If you didn't ingest dolphins, why do you suggest that you do publicly? And if you don't suggest that, why do I have the false impression that you do? And if I don't impress anybody with my dolphins, where did you collect the spores that you forced down into the jars that were not containing alphabet soup? But were containing the principal concoction that I believe is being made here in the States in the courts. This factory is full of beef, ham, and all the long lozenges that you make of desiccated beef have added up in my soul to produce something that is far too foul to be considered part of the daily strain of life. And I know you strain when you hear these things, but what do you expect me to use as a colander for the soul to get the chunky bits of unrendered cow mucus out of my doorknob before it rattles all night and keeps me asleep because every time I see this, it's the same five bridges, six dog long, seven dog short, and I don't mind when they're short, but when they're long, it throws off the patterns, and the patterns are what it's all about for me. I don't pay rent at six places so that these patterns can be thrown off in the final phase of the cycle, and yet you know what I'm saying, and yet that's the condition that you would like to approve for me going forward, and I do not like that. It doesn't seem stately when you remark to the people who weren't available that they are available. Because what am I supposed to think now? Oh, I wasn't available. I am. I wasn't. I am. That seems wrong to me, and it seems wrong to you, because the memos that they sent did not discursively amplify the treatment center for that kind of subterranean sewage, the cundity that resulted in a huge spike in the rat population in Rhodesia. It spiked the rhododendron population in Rotitis, and every rat tite that I've seen since has hated Derren, and that is the worst population control mechanism I've ever seen. I felt tight when I was wearing that holster, but the whole solstice was upon me, and I didn't have much time to contemplate the constriction. I didn't feel that your diction was clear, but I felt like your result was the main antidote to my outcome. So I had to cancel all of that in my area and your area end in the general area of the universe. So hammer time, but not like you stop hammer time, where you don't stop smashing until the skull chunks are so small that you couldn't get an accurate sense of the curvature, and thus the size of the original intact skull, because the chunks left are basically just flakes. Bro, and I don't like having to flake up your skull, but I don't exactly hate it either. So just think about that part. Beef Perengeti in the Serengeti is a really unacceptable form of destiny fulfillment. When I think of basements, I think of sock drawers. I think of spark plugs. I think of all the tiny beads that pop out of your nostril when you think no one's looking. When you take the kind of perloid breath mints that are designed to treat your inner sanctum with biomes and medical devices and enzymes never intended to be consumed, and you crunch them with your teeth to let them dribble down your chin. So that's a good ambassador. 
knows that you are not making a mockery of his customs. You are making a mockery of his face, then his shoes fall off. Then all is revealed, and when the room slips away like with summer wind, and the true nature of reality lays exposed like a simmering, sizzling scaffold of interweaving connections. All reinforce each other, my God, you think for yourself, dear Lord. You think to yourself, for the first time, I see it. I understand what it is, and then when that enzyme breath freshener hits your taste buds, you'll be pulled right back to reality, remembering. Oh yeah, I'm drooling all over my boss's desk and he's probably going to fire me. That's when I suggest you whip out the old way. Don't worry, ladies. If you can't do this, it's a simple backup. You just pop out the old tatters, and that usually does the trick. Cable Car Fulfillment Center was not repelled sufficiently by the latest magnetic offering from Amiga, so we had to pull six of the trends together in tandem to make us sort of Tandy Commodore 64. That was really only actually 25, and when the impenetrable door knocker of defenestration came to our legal landscaping party, they pointed out that it was not the prestigious hotel, but a landscaping company with the same name. Dump Truck Landscaping Pump Hole Dingus Larpa. He woke up each Sunday and he went to sleep each Sunday, so he was pretty consistent in that regard that particular Friday. However, he was in a coma. He had been hit by a bus filled with rakes, driven by a madman named Looney, the Peat, who lived at a Frankfurter factory that was deep in the heart of Dublin. When he woke up, he also woke up so he had that in common with himself. When he filled up a rake bus, he didn't expect that he would hit himself in the leg with his own bus, but that's what happened. He hit the brakes hard because the rakes were scarred, but when he saw the dude lying right there on the tar, he figured old crap. I think that's me. I'm lying in the road, bro. How could this be? But the rakes told him, son, that don't matter at all. Just run yourself over and then give us a call. This is Injury Pete, the corpse doctor. I will fight for you. Have you been killed on the job? I will not rest until I've eaten every last scrap of meat clinging to your dead, dead bones. I fight for all of my clients, fight thee against the peristalsis that keeps them from going down, 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 down my gullet ever faster. I gulp and gulp ragged, fleshy chunks of your dead body so you will not be able to be taken advantage of by corporate mega drones. Is air as deep as space or does sky fly as high as it goes? Can you fly more high than sky if the air doesn't dry up? Or do you need to bring your own air to sky it out? I think it's one thing to place oxygen in a tank, but it's another thing to place embryo in a sock, swing it over your head, and with all the might of a dust ball, plop yourself on the couch, ready for some classic football bashing entertainment between two baseball bats named George and Charlie. As you recall that the tulip in your ear socket is really a wrench, and you have washed your 2,000 parts as clean as you need to with the mustard you got from a guy who led mustard when you cut his throat. Apparently much to your surprise. What is surprising mustard throat? This guy has dripping down into your mouth, and how good that mustard tastes so coppery, so tangy with the heat of the mustard man that produced it when you bit his mustardy, mustardy hot dog neck. How often have we looked ourselves in the mirror and realized we were crouching in the neighbor's yard at 3 a.m. holding a squirrel that was clawing our face in terror and thinking, my God, my God, how does this man know what I'm thinking? I'm a squirrel, my God, my God. What a guy. How like a God is this man whose nose? I've practically scratched off in my terror. How ineffable are his movements informed? Like an angel, a Lord heavenly host preserve our saints and God almighty. Let's slip the hallowed dogs of war on the moonlit hill of the crest of thine ear. Tis the nightingale, saith the bird, and that is the true meaning of fiduciary productivity, declension, and indemnification, agreement clauses in Africa, fritter recipes around the world, thanks to a new TikTok trend called clocks that is making each ticking count as one second of talking and saving us half the time so we don't have to talk nearly as much. I take all the boxes for a fat load of crock because I like crockery and I like Spock chalks a lot. I made a mockery of your toboggan incense chapel motto, but I didn't know that you had so much shrapnel embedded in your grotto of tobacco logs. You got my knob throbbing, practically popping out my jerking because I'm more than a little quirky when it comes to lurking. I might be hiding in your cupboards, rubbing all your gherkins, 
You never know what kind of trouble come knocking when you got bumble buzzard with a guzzling gizzard buzzer lurking. It's a lot of pocket tacos crashing. The embargo banquet this sunny seaside and I do not know how often the lambago will allow me to let go your omelette. You know how do we fit in this Winnebago and why would we lurk it? Why would we seek to jerk around my little Polly Pocket Pollyanna Pony Prettiness Parade? And why would we put pomade on it? Why would we slick back our goose grease and just aim for the skids while we shoot down that bird and flick them off as well because of their pooling vaginal secretions that are odiferous and highly refractive to ultraviolet frequencies? Do you ever hide inside a purple tunnel and then call yourself the indigo? Patrolmen, do you ever harness six birds on roller skates and let them pull you? And do you ever try wearing the roller skates yourself and letting the birds fly and pull you that way? I like to kneel in front of easels and pour Weasley grief needle point packets of possible potentiometer puddling because nothing is more greasy than an oil, fire, flame, doused and righteous holy water. That is holy. Not available to evaporate in the spring, but come fall. It loads up the air with hot droplets that you can feel burn holes in the flower petals with its questing, thirsting tongues. 30 thought police pachyderms piled potential predation pantaloon pockets into their funnel cake. And boy ecky, if it didn't burn their funnel cake up, because those kinds of pocket protecting cargo capers didn't burn a holy brisket into their war army. They took the whole brigade with them on a downward slope that resulted in treachery counter treachery. And ultimately, the defeasalment of all like could noni dine could wood did. Should wood do it, but non fonidine did not come on lanadine flouting out when he hauled and howled, didn't come out and haul. He did the prowling at the mall as a matter of last resort. He didn't consent to accost his jeweler, he consorted with the most. All the fiend in the world could weld, but melding it together does not make it. So if we crimp and say we cannot dance but dally, and if we curtsy our courtesy would sway even the most marble of minds into rolling a gutter ball, into the snaking pathways that lay behind beyond beneath, and to one very, very lopsided vertex of all that remains transgressive, and will cease to transfix itself against the wall, but instead render it through an evil aggress into the worst purple we could ever spark in the hope of our laundry, because the grounding wire came loose 15 years ago, and we have no visual indicator of the danger. We are all so desperately in. I could burn the slope down if it went upwards, but unfortunately, the angle doesn't permit that action at this time from my current point of origination. If you could give me a lift up the mountain, I could probably slope it on down, but you know it's rich. If you could mosey on down to your boys in a ditch, the only ditch sauce that is ranch approved, and we could sign off on the deed to this cow that moves Purple Pig doesn't delete me. Purple Pig doesn't even want to defeat me. Purple Pig barely can eat me. But when I see the aquamarine dog, I know it will beat me. Fire Castle is a very dangerous castle, and I wouldn't recommend being the king of that place, because you are obligated to live in a castle that shoots fire at all times. Rows and rows of stacks of blocks that look like class from a distance seem to evaporate upon approach, and one wonders if this is an artifact of the engine in the cyclical tower of binding, or if it is more of a sign of impending cranial imprint of the new pattern, suggest Murfreesboro knocks up a lockdown before it pops out a gold edition, which we do not believe in at all. I've been locked in the hockey and can't make for 16 fortnights, and over seven blizzards have occurred deep in winter space that cannot be accounted for. By earthly means, Saturn appears to be in retro development, whereas Arbitra is in sixth grade, but where is only modern accoutrements. Sneezeguard Havoc Maker shook himself to the core when he invented a new topographical resurgence that made a mockery of the judiciary, even as it emblazoned its imprints upon a festoon worth of bullion and bobbles that amounted to merely trinket museum in waiting to anyone who could have afforded the glass cases and rent for a medium-sized office landscape. Bounty replete with memes spies, none it doesn't fight for the beast of seems take two doesn't free yourself. It's not like a ghoul, but it can precipitate like a depending drool. 
a bead of pissy spit that spits out piss while you kick back and crap yourself a future snack. Light Lemon Emission 7. Salmon Deficiency. Glam Rock Proficiency Chicken Skate Doesn't Do So Great, Declaw, Raga Sock Draw, Mama Bopper Bunk, and Dinosaur Diaper. Daddy Wants Swamper, Whopper Bop. Judge Wapner, Locked Up in a Sweatshop. 1400 years ago, of Party of Five, Dove in Head First, and Rock the Court with news of the Burley game that was in common with core features of the amphibious albatross family and the larger extended wheelbarrow bearings of the 40s and 50s. For over 700 feet tall at the time, which you can imagine was quite hostile to older gentlemen in their teens and younger short people with no wheelchairs growing out of their necks. It was a healing hardy time to be apart from the soup canning factory that didn't just can the stuff it fired. It outright from cannons that I believe were measured in the feet, and some of them did have hands, but these were merely decorative. And if you were to put your own hand next to one of these, you would quickly see that your own hand possessed a much higher degree of movement and joints functioning joints. If you can function after a joint, then you might be eligible for tie discounts at Local High in Thai, a place where guys that get high in ties, but aren't high in time. Stop on down for a speedy selection of one of our most up-to-date sativa salads. It tastes like melody because by the time you finish it, you're balked as a begonia. The less that we piled into the pyramid, the more top-heavy it turbulently totaled, so we tended to trade tropical traditions for more manageable muffin-making management. Is it tough bell buttons that we had popped into? Our clavicle really rang that resonantly, so we resolved that any resolution we make going forward would be at least partial enough to consist of a fragment, if not less. And if it was more often than not, then it would be less, not than often, that we didn't knot that because otherwise there would be a more than not often factor to factor in that couldn't be accounted for unless we did not. In fact, often more than we didn't often, which as far as I know is not the case. 